In this video, we will look at the horizontal alignment in planes in more detail. The horizontal alignment is the shape of the road when viewed from above, sort of like a map, although engineering drawings have more information. The view from above is called the plan view, or plan for short. Construction drawings usually have a number of plans showing all or parts of the road from above. The diagram to the left shows a plan of the road, while the photo to the right shows it as it was constructed. Note the plans are produced before construction and are used to do the construction. But in this video we are using the drawings of a road that has already been constructed, so I can show you what is actually built. Note the plan and the actual photo are almost exactly the same, as you would expect. You can view the, view the full set of drawings on the Moodle site. I have added a not northern point at the top of the plan. This allows you to orientate the plan correctly. This is especially important on site as you need to read the plan the right way up. The horizontal alignment is concerned with where the road is actually located, as well as the straights and bends that make up the road. The bends need to be designed so the vehicle can get around them safely. Sharp bends can be dangerous, especially if the road leading up to the bend allows high speed. So the bends need to be as long and gentle as possible. You can see the bend here, sh shown in the photo, is smooth and constant. Looking at the plan, you can see numbers along the centre line of the road, starting at 0 at the bottom of the drawing and going up in increments of 20. These numbers are a measure of the distance in metres from the start of the project to the point, and is called the chainage. Chainage may also be referred to as running distance, or RD. Chainage allows you to specify the location of a section of row. For example, the intersection with the second road is between 40 and 60 metre chainage points, so it is at chainage 50. Note it is also the start of the chainage for the second road that goes to the right of the plan. Other drawings show only part of the works, so the chainage allows you to distinguish what part you're looking at. During construction, we often put pegs in at each chainage point to help workers construct the road in the right location and to the required levels. So chainage allows us to link what is on the drawings and with what is on the ground. Note that the second road leading off to the right of the plan also has chainage points which start from the intersection, but the chainage for that road is prefixed with 1, so each chainage point has a different value. Note also that there are red arrow arrows with AA, BB, CC, etc. on the plan. These are the locations of typical cross sections that are located on a separate drawing. The arrows indicate the direction of the cross section is viewed from. So AA, BB and CC cross sections are viewed from the south of the line. The plan is often shows the location of features shown in other drawings. We will look at a typical cross section CC in the next video.